Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today we are doing just a quick video um, and I'm going to be doing a milk bath ombre nail. Um, so I've already gone in, applied tips, prep the nail. Now I'm going in at the tip of the nail with CJP's coconut milk. Yeah, coconut milk. Um, and I'm applying that at the free edge of the natural nail and then fading that down towards the cuticle and then patting that up over the free edge of the nail and this is going to act as our base for our flowers so i'm going to do that on all of the nails the brush that i'm using is of course the cjp big boy brush So once I'd applied that to all of the nails, I'm now going in with a small wet bead of clear acrylic and I'm just placing on some tiny, tiny dry flowers. These are from Glitterati Nails um, and you get quite a lot of them in a pack. Um, and I just broke some of them off and just going to place those on the tip of the nail where we have just put the clear acrylic. And I'm also going to add some little iridescent shards of glitter as well. Um, I thought this would give a really nice effect and just make them look a little bit cuter but I think I went in with a bit too much coconut milk over the top of these because you can actually see it in the end but hey ho <laughs> I know it's there <laughs> so I'm just going to go ahead and apply flowers to all of the nails and wait for that to set before going in with anything else because if we go in with any other colours now then we will end up moving all of those flowers that we've just put down. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go ahead and apply some of the coconut milk acrylic powder. But what I have done is I've mixed some of the coconut milk with some clear acrylic in a separate pot um, just to make it a little bit more transparent. And then I'm going to go over the top of the flowers with this um, acrylic that I've made. So if you don't have a more transparent um, white, then you can just go ahead and add a little bit of clear to your white. Make sure you give it a good shake up and that will be perfect for this look. Um, so I'm going to apply that to all of the nails. Doesn't matter if some parts have more transparency than others or some you can't see some of the flowers. It does not matter. That's what's going to give it the milk bath effect. So I'm going to go ahead and just do that on all of the nails. Thank you. 
Now it's time to move on and create the ombre. So I'm using CJP's Frosted Rose for this. And I'm taking a bead of Frosted Rose, draining the back of the bead on um, some paper towel, placing that at the cuticle area and then bringing that up over the flowers. It doesn't matter if you go all the way over because it is such a translucent powder. Um, but this is gonna create your ombre as if it was, as if you were doing a normal ombre nail. Um, this is how we are going to create it. So always make sure you drain the back of your bead and just placing that at the cuticle area and then bringing that up over the rest of the nail. And then I will go in and encapsulate these in clear acrylic as well. If we don't encapsulate them, um, when we come to file, obviously you're gonna file off all your flowers and all your beautiful work that you've just done. So I will do this bit and I'll jump back on in a sec. So once I had done my ombre and all of them, I'm now going in with clear acrylic from CJP and just encapsulating all these nails, making sure all the flowers are encapsulated um, and making sure that they've got a nice apex. Then once this was set, I then went in and filed the nails using a hand file. Um, the nails kept popping out again, so I don't have the filing on camera, but I just went in with a nail file and filed the surface of the nail, the cuticle area and the side walls. Um, and made sure that it had a nice sharp shape to it. Then I will get rid of the dust before going in and top coating, which is definitely my favorite part of doing a set of nails. So as I said, I'm now going in with my Nail Lounge Collections Ultimate Gloss Top Coat and I'm gonna top coat these beautiful nails. My lighting was a little bit off today. Um, I don't know why, but my lighting hasn't been great today. I don't know if it's because it's sunny outside, I have no idea, but you can see what I'm doing. <laughs> um, so I'm just gonna top coat all of the nails and then cure that for one minute in my LED lamp. If you're curing, if you're using a UV lamp, then you do need to cure for at least two minutes. Then I'll let those cool before going in and applying some cuticle oil. And then that would be it. So it's just a nice, quick, simple video today, guys. Um, I'm gonna try and do something fun with the kids. We've been a little bit bored and we're running out of ideas. <laughs> so if anyone's got any ideas of fun stuff to do with kids, they are three and six. Please let me know because Louis just keeps asking if we can go out and obviously we can't go out. Um, so yeah, please let me know if you have any ideas on what I could do with them. So I'm going to love you and leave you there, guys. Thank you so much for watching. 
Don't forget, if you like this video, show the love and give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, click the subscribe button. And I will see you all very soon in my next video. Bye.